This storm was pretty complex with what it was uh, delivering to Florida. Rather, that was tornadoes, wind, flooding. We saw a lot of it. So uh, it made landfall near Siesta Key as a Category 3 hurricane. So a major hurricane there in Florida. It made its way through Central Florida, and now it's well off coast and in the Atlantic. Some areas saw over 100 mile per hour wind gust, one being uh, in the Albert Wittet Airport. So look at this. This right here is just one area near landfall. You see the power went out and so several people saw that uh, going more towards the wind and more of the wind damage. There's video of that. Again, 100 mile per hour wind gust was seen in a lot of places. So there's several videos of that and here's some of that wind damage here. You can can see structural damage on the roadways downtowns and to those other areas and then tornadoes. You know, that's also well away from the tornado. This was actually near West Palm Beach and that faces the Atlantic. There was over 100 tornado warnings in Florida that was issued and uh, went off yesterday. So it was impacts were felt no matter if you were on the Gulf Coast of Florida or the Atlantic Coast. Of course, thoughts and uh, you know, any help that we can get is certainly there for Florida as they went through a lot and this was a powerful storm. Again, its impacts are now well out into the ocean, so we are not going to see any of the impacts as well as now it's making its way into the Atlantic.